Matthew chapter 26, verse 57 through 75. Those who had arrested Jesus took him to Caiaphas, the high priest, where all the elders and the teachers of the law had assembled. But Peter followed them at a distance, right up to the courtyard of the high priest. He entered and sat down with the guards to see the outcome. Now the high priest, chief priest, and all the elders of the people uh, were looking for false evidence so that they might accuse Jesus and have him put to death. But they did not find any, though many false witnesses came forward. Finally two came forward who said, This fellow said, I am able to destroy the temple of God and rebuild it in three days. Then the high priest stood up and said to Jesus, Are you not going to answer? What is this testimony that these men have brought against you? But Jesus remained silent. Then the high priest said, I charge you under oath by the living God. Tell us if you are the Christ, the Son of God. Yes, it is as you say, Jesus answered. But I say to every one of you, you will see the Son of Man sitting at the right hand of the Mighty One and coming on the clouds of heaven. Then the high priest tore his clothes and said, He has spoken blasphemy. Why do we need any other witnesses? Look, you have heard the blasphemy. What do you think? He is worthy of death, they declared. Then they spit in his face and they uh, struck him with their fist. Others slapped him and said, Prophesy to us, Christ, who hit you? Now Peter was sitting out in the courtyard. And a girl came to him and said, You also were with Jesus of Galilee. But he denied it in front of them all. I don't know what you're talking about. And Peter went out into the gateway where another girl saw him and said to those standing there, This fellow was with Jesus of Nazareth. Peter denied it again with an oath. I don't know the man. A little while later, others that were standing nearby came to him and said, Surely you are one of them, for your accent gives you away. Then Peter began to call out curses on himself. And he swore to them, I don't know the man. Immediately a rooster crowed. And Peter remembered the words that Jesus had said to him. Before the rooster crows, you would disown me three times. And he went outside and wept bitterly.